Let's talk about the nine layers of hell. Dante's Inferno. Dante Alighieri was an Italian writer who is best known for his poem Inferno, a story that depicts the nine circles of hell. According to Dante, hell is located at the center of the earth, and the deeper you go in towards the earth's core, the more torturous it gets. All right, so I'm going to describe each level, and you let me know which level you think you'd be on. I wonder I wonder if we'd be on the same level. Maybe you'd be on level one, limbo. If you're a good person, but you're not a Christian, this is where you'd be. Dante says that Socrates and Julius Caesar are here. Second Second circle is reserved for those who, for when they were alive, were ruled by lust. Dante says that this is where Cleopatra is. Third circle of hell, according to Dante, is reserved for overeaters, and their punishment is to eternally be eaten by dogs. Followed by the fourth circle, which is for the greedy money hoarders. Their punishment is to push giant money bags uphill for all of eternity. Fifth is for people who were angry and mean spirited. If you're atheist or agnostic, your room would be located on the sixth level. Seventh layer is stacked. Murderers, war makers, people who commit crimes against nature, they're all on the seventh level. While the eighth is for various types of fraudsters. Seducing fraudsters are whipped for eternity. Priests who stole money from the church are eternally baptized in fire. And Dante also puts fortune tellers and astrologers here. Um, and their punishment is for their heads to be twisted all the way around so that way they can no longer see the future. The final layer of hell is reserved for the people who were traitors, disloyal, people who betrayed their country, people who betrayed their families, which is why at the very center of hell, you will find Satan, the ultimate sinner who betrayed God. Do you think that you'd be in Dante's Inferno or do you think you would have made it to heaven? Get in the comments and let me know.